closer to the monster, please. And he takes a powder and jump back. A little farther, Tim. Find the light. All right, here we go. Yeah, thank you. And clear, please. And it's amazing to me, all these years later, how people are still coming up and talking about that it has this lasting effect and impact. Its enduring power may come from the chords it strikes among all of us. We're all human beings, and we were all children once. Pop culture has taken ownership of this miniseries. It scared the hell out of millions of people. <laughs> Advertisers were very nervous. This was a children in jeopardy story. We were breaking new grounds because I don't remember before any kind of material like this that I saw on television. The only source of disappointment for me is, was the fact that we couldn't go as raw and as bold as they did in the in the book. One of the comments is, is typically, Tim Curry is the reason why I'm terrified of clowns. Steve's particular spin was to take something that's much loved and familiar and ratchet it up as far as it could possibly go. Wow. Tim could act to a manhole cover because he has that kind of charisma and presence. He brought more to the character than was written on the page. I saw it as a fantasy character. It was an illusion that it's presenting to these children. I wanted it to almost be like a living cartoon. And he said, if you want me to wear this scary makeup, then I think you have the wrong actor. And I thought, what? I'll kill you all. Our director came to me, and he said, Jim, I'm losing it with these kids. If it were filmed now with that same group of kids, there would be a lot of them who had diagnoses, maybe ADHD, oppositional defiance. Some of them just would not shut up. <laughs> we got in a lot of trouble. We were kids, both on set and off. <laughs> we couldn't get the next, like, three or four takes. The adults, they were actually more noisy than the kids. No, it didn't happen. And I want to apologize right now. That's it. You have to do your job. Most TV movies disappear into oblivion. I think the fact that it is consistently played on cable has opened it to a much wider audience. You say it, and people say Tim Curry. Down here we all flow. <laughs>